I always say, Daddy got to work on that plane. And they like, oh, so what are you doing? I'm like, I got to fix the engines today. Oh, I changed a couple of tires. And they're like, oh, you know how to change brakes and stuff on airplanes? Yeah, that's always pretty cool. I've always had a fascination uh, with airplanes and how they work and how do some of these big airplanes get up into the sky. That's always been my thing. So I'm able to learn and work on these planes here. So it's pretty cool. In order for me to become an AMT, I had to get the, the proper certification, the AMP license. So that led me to Jefferson Community College. I, I can't say enough about it. The instructors there like really pushed all of the students and making sure we understood and helped us when, when we didn't understand it. So I, I really enjoyed that. and. You know, I get to see these planes all the time and I was so anxious to get out here and learn. And like I tell my wife and my daughter all the time, never in a million years I thought I would be driving one of these planes around UPS ramp. You know, that's, that's the cool part about it. Once you get qualified, you, you get to do stuff like this. My favorite things to do are like the engine changes more, the bigger work. So that's why I chose the weekend crew. So I get to dig in, get dirty, change engines, work work on the wings, landing gear, anything you can imagine I get to, get to touch and do. My story, and I always preach this to everybody, if I can do it, you can do it too. So I originally started uh, out at UPS as a forklift driver five days a week, as well as going to Jefferson Community Technical College. I would get off here in the morning time, literally have to pick up my oldest daughter, drop her off at school, went to school after I dropped her off, got out of school, go pick her back up, go home, have a little supper with, with my wife and my daughters, take a nap, come back in here. Did it for two and a half years, Monday through Friday. Honestly, uh, a lot of prayer, a lot of determination, uh, a lot of support from my wife. Those were some of the big things that got me through it. And that was my biggest thing. I just wanted to provide for my family. So Jefferson opened doors to a career and a better life for me and my family. Being able to share my story to inspire or give somebody the determination that they need to go back to school to achieve their dreams and start a career path to support the family, you know? Uh, I'm big on family and, you know, just being there to take care of them and give them a better life. Yeah.